This is a Thor News presentation. Thor News presents... Guys, I'm bringing the party to you. Fox, business can hardly keep up with the corporate crime. Barclays, J.P. Morgan Chase. There's a storm coming. Let me move on to the Eurozone. It seems that any headline coming out of Europe really is moving markets all over the uh, all over the world, particularly in the United States. L-I-B-O-R. We have to talk about LIBOR. Now there's an interest rate rigging scandal that has been rocking Barclays. It's all about LIBOR. It's all about the case because LIBOR is such an important benchmark rate. Systematically rigging rates. L-I-B-O-R. Systematically rigging rates. Hundreds of trillions of dollars. LIBOR. What? First of all, what is it? Not sure. The London Interbank offered rate. I so serious. Again, this is the interest rate that impacts all kinds of loans, including the pricing of trillions of dollars of derivatives or swaps. is considered a widespread and serious issue. You know, what do I care what rate banks in London are lending to each other? But this is sort of the underlying basis for the whole entire system. Here we go again, another example of bankers behaving badly. Almost all the big important rates in the economy I can think of, LIBOR. the LIBOR, is, yep. the LIBOR is, is the easiest to manipulate. The bank Barclays is under siege right now. It admits findings that the bank rigged the London Interbank Offered Rate, or LIBOR as it's called. And they've had to take this 290 million yeah. pound fine, a record fine, because there have been rigging rates, systematically rigging rates. You know, Citigroup's involved, J.P. Morgan's involved, Bank of America's involved in terms of setting this rate. So if they were colluding, as, as the allegations going back years, if it's all of them, this is a huge deal. At least 12 other banks are under investigation, possibly yeah. as many as 18. The regulators are once again asleep at the switch. And this is what we know now. It could just be the tip of the iceberg. So what, what's next? What happens now? I think that uh, there should be a lot of punitive actions taken against this company. Because if you think about it, LIBOR is the base rate for loan securities around the world. Supposedly, there are some $800 trillion worth of securities, loans, derivatives, etc. that are based upon the LIBOR price. If they're rigging that, they're, they're really messing up the system in a horrible way. Regulatory problems could be the tip of the iceberg in terms of the legal quagmire that is ahead. Because all you people want is more, 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 more! Say, why do all these big banks have all the power? They're schemers. Schemers trying to control their little worlds. LIBOR. Regulatory capture. Anytime you look under the rock of regulation, you'll find the nastiest of malfeasances. <laughs>